All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to my Crusader Kings 2 series, where today we are, of course, still playing as the Principality of Amalfi with our now 47 year old Grand Prince Juan Cant II of Amalfi. And today, my friends, <laughs> I'm in a wonderful mood because we are in yet another crusade against the Mongols this time. <laughs> and oh, how I love a good crusade! Crusade. If all goes well, which I'm pretty sure it will, we're gonna get this big old chunk of the Mongolian Empire right here, which I'm debating whether or not I just want to hand it over to Kumania or create a new kingdom here for Kumania to then fight with to keep them occupied. That might potentially be a good plan. I mean, I can hold another vassal, but I don't know. Do uh, Kumania is already by far my biggest vassal in my empire, so I don't think I really want to make him any bigger. But at the same time, do I really want another person to join factions against me? Because you know they will. They always do. Even after I give them all those beautiful tracts of land, they inevitably want something like freaking council power. Ugh. But oh well, for now, we have our beautiful crusade, which our armies are down here, sieging out the primary targets, and it does look like the Mongolians have gained one ally, which you are you. Oh, 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 bless, you're tiny. Oh, you're not gonna make one lick of difference in this war. Uh, all right, yeah, we're still good, we're still good. <laughs> This should go quite nicely for us. I, I doubt I'll have to bring out my levies. I'm holding them off for the time being because I think my retinue and my mercenaries will be just fine. And plus, just in case a faction suddenly gets dangerously powerful, I would like my levies to be with the bulk of my empire for, you know, that potential eventuality. So yeah, I think we're, I think we're going to be good with this. I just wish more of my people would join. I mean, I've joined. Where the hell is the rest of the Catholic Christendom? Uh, oh, well, let's just unpause and go for it. I mean, come on, Bulgaria, you should join. You're, you're Catholic, right? I have no idea if you're Catholic or not. Are you? Nope, you're Orthodox. <gasps> A heretical Orthodox at that. Eh. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, the Summon of Alexandria has usurped a title. Good for him. Yeah, Sicily doing some things, inheriting some stuff. Do they still, uh, they still hold Iceland? They do. They do. I don't, I don't know why that always amuses me so much, but I love the fact that in this world, Iceland is owned by Sicily. Okay, my brave knights have captured the target of the crusade, Chuck. Wait, hold on. Where's Chuck? Let's, uh, is that one of my sieges? Nope, it's one of the Pope's sieges. Or actually, not even the Pope. Who the hell are you? Who the? Oh, you're Kumania. Of course, of course. Wait, but you're not in the war. Uh, I don't know. I don't care. They got the war target. I'm, I'm happy. Oh, oh God, hold on. I gotta click you. Then I want to check you. Your, oh, my daughter. <laughs> oh, Vendane, the potentially possessed demonic child of mine. I had actually almost forgotten about that. Oh boy. Oh boy, all right, well, you're gonna be diplomatic because I'm definitely not giving you stabbery. Oh, that'd be bad. <laughs> all right, my courtier Stefano has requested to join the Knights of Santiago. Do I care about you in the slightest? Nope, really don't. All right, go with my blessing. Have fun, join the Knights. There we go. Okay, so we got war target over there. That's good. <laughs> yeah, good old Kumania. All right. We've almost got some things over here. We're at 34%. I'm hoping by the end of today's episode, we should be... <gasps> yes! Yes! I also forgot, um, and I'm very excited about the fact that we're still trying to kill off the Urso family. And apparently, my wife is the one that's gonna do it this time. Oh, the good old castle parapet trick, lovely. This poor 13 year old child is going to take a tumble. All right, well, fly little bird, fly. 
Uh, does, should it worry me that my wife is the one doing that? Maybe she has plots for me. <laughs> Actually, I think we're friends right now. Yeah, she likes me. Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right. Success! The child is dead. Oh my god. I, uh, I'm awful. <laughs> Okay, he died quickly, presumably a painless death. Okay, good for him. Oh, hello, there's the sound. And a new great house has risen. <laughs> the Savelli house. They are, oh wait, hold on. There is the right one. Oh, no, no, I was about to say, Savelli sounds familiar. It's the Bellioingi. Oh, I butchered that pronunciation. <laughs> Ooh, boy. <laughs> okay. Well, have fun with your sad, pathetic little group. I'm gonna enjoy my glorious, gigantic trade empire. Okay, who's the next greatest threat? This family. Can I kill you? Ooh, I could. Ah, crap, he's on the council. What does he do on the council? Now he's my chancellor. Well, actually, I really don't care too much about that position at the moment. Perhaps we do start ending that family as well. Hmm. Which, man, they have also not done anything to their palace. What the hell? What about you? Oh, you're working on a shrine. Ooh, yay. <laughs> I mean, I can understand these two families. They're the newest, but you two have been around for a while. You should have been able to at least upgrade one freaking thing. I mean, look at my family. We did it all. <sighs> that was the first thing I spent, you know, my focus on was to build up this. <laughs> all right, well, we got a new family. Maybe I just killed them too. <laughs> we could. We could certainly do it. I am 15 over my trade port limit. Awesome. <laughs> oh, it makes me so happy. Yeah, I should kill them. <laughs> well, we're plotting to kill. There we go. Let's destroy another family. Gotta maintain my power. Make sure the other families don't uh, get any ideas of grandeur within our glorious morrow ruled empire ha ah, my beautiful family how many of us are there now 246 living members 1452 total ah lovely yay money I definitely need that since I'm losing it at the moment okay Actually, let me check on this his family. How many does he have? How many do I have to kill? 14? That's doable. <laughs> I am an awful person. My determination and oh my god, he's the one teaching me another language. Oh, but I think we're actually done at this now. Yes. Yes, this just reminded me about that, but yes, we're done. So my determination and hard work has paid off. Studying with Patrician Isidoros, you have learned several new languages to a decent level of fluency. This will surely increase your prestige at foreign courts. And yay, one diplomacy and one learning. And I'm sorry, sir, though you have served me well, it's time for you to die. Your, your family is a threat to mine. Oh no. Holy crap, I forgot I was ill. Well, we're not anymore, so that's good. <laughs> oh, thank God. Oh, I really forgot about that. I even was thinking at the end of the last episode, I should look for a new heir. Well, we're good now. We're good now. Got how old am I again? 48 now? Hmm. All right, how many more sieges we got on this? Quite a few. Hmm. All right, that's going to take a while. Hey, we're up to 50%. Awesome. Kamania continues to siege. Good. Good. The Duchor kingdoms. Yeah, we are in the right place. Yeah, they were too, so that's... That's all that. Okay. So yeah, I just kind of need to siege the crap out of this area, and we should be okay. Ooh, someone else just got... Aha! They just got some things. Who are you? Ah, the papacy with Gascona. Right. Awesome. Up to 56%. Beautiful. 
This tiny little part of the world will be our battle map. And we shall thrive in it and destroy them. Yay, another siege! 66! I'm actually, you know what? You're a big army. Let's, uh, send you there. Actually, go there. Kill him. There we go. Then we'll be sieging out three areas. Do this a little bit more quickly. Perfect. Perfect. I may have to call up my boats even sooner than I anticipated. Lovely! And we'll kill a tiny little army of 250 people. <laughs> oh, it's good. So yeah, uh, I am 100% of the contribution to the crusade at the moment. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. And we just keep earning those points. Oh, I'm so happy. What is this? Oh, Ventane. Oh, yeah. Okay. Young Van Dane seems to have a lot of independent opinions and refuses to listen to the priests. Of course she refuses to listen to the priest. She's a crazy little devil girl. And oh, hey, look at that, a little army coming. <laughs> oh, oh, they think they can do something with 4,000 people. Well, yeah, boy. Um, yeah, what the hell? I'll let that, I'll let that go. I'm, uh, I'm curious to see where this leads. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, and another 5,000 coming from over here of the Mongols. Hmm. Ooh, yes, a writer wanting to compose my family chronicles. Ooh, that costs gold. Hmm. Hmm. Still though, 15, negative 15, or negative 5 rather, to all of my dynasty members' opinions for 10 years. Plus, my family is glorious and does need to be heralded. Boom. There we go. Screw being humble. <laughs> Ooh, they have 12,000 now. They're actually starting to become a threat. Oh, they're coming down here. Really? You really? You're going to attack there? You fools. All right. Let's get you into Samarkand and uh, start getting into a position there. And I'll have you jump in once things are appropriate. Right about now. Oh, nope, he stopped. Crap. You stopped too. I was uh, a little bit off on my timing. <laughs> oh, I want to destroy his little army. I mean, we're about to get another. S oh, God, I'm paused. Oh, jeez. The defeat! <gasps> what? Jihad for Egypt! Oh, two arms, apparently, two arms. Oh, great, we're in a jihad now, too. Oh, God. The great Shia Caliph Usama has decided to call a jihad against the Kafirs and the most serene republic of Egypt. He urges all righteous Shia Muslims to take up arms against the depraved Grand Prince Buan Kant II of Amalfi for the glory of Islam. Oh, you fool, you're going to die. In fact... Ah, crap, only 47%. Really? <laughs> Now two arms. We're at war now. Yeah. Yeah, we got that siege. Oh, they actually did a thing over there. Hmm. Well, back over here. This is what I really gotta watch right now at the moment. Hey, young merchant enclave built. I forgot I was building that. So where is he heading to now? I don't know, but we're at 85! What the hell just happened? Created a what? what? I created a Oh, we won! Oh, we <laughs> oh, we we won our war. I, you know, the sound and all the pop-ups. I thought my guy died for a second, and we had a new a new emperor. But no, no, we suddenly magically won the war, and I have apparently created the Serene Republic of Kiva. And uh, okay, a successful crusade. Pause. Pause. Holy crap, yay. Oh, 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 yeah, no, we weren't going to get that, were we? That was... Yes, Turkestan. Okay, okay. You know what? I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. We now have a sizable chunk of Russia. <laughs> yes. Yes. And now I'm holding, holy crap, 52 titles. Oh, boy. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Um, hmm. 
All right. So what's this war doing? What's what's uh? He's, he's got some friends in that. He's got some friends. <sighs> he wants Egypt, huh? Oh crap! I gotta get my armies over there. Portugal, do something. You're actually in this war, aren't you? Right? Yeah, you're in. You're in the war. Good. Oh wait, no, that's the Portuguese holy war for Arabia. Oh, yep, yeah, no, good, good, good. You also have the Shia Jihad for Egypt. All right, well. That's annoying. You got a nice big army there, though. Hopefully you run into some enemies over here to kill. And the rest of this episode's probably going to be pretty boring for you guys because... <laughs> oh, hey, we're known as the Great. Awesome. But uh, we now have to dole out all this land. All this land. <sighs> okay, let's get going. Oh, yeah, wrong types, of course. All right, okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, so you, I'm just going to go ahead and with the bishoprics, do what I usually do, create new vassal. Ah, uh, that's, that's bishopric, okay. Uh, da -da -da. Create new vassal. Create new vassal. Yep, your little bishop brick two. Create new vassal. Create new vassal. Okay, perfect. I think fun again. I mean, I can't really do. I can build a fort. <laughs> huh? Castletown, parents. No. No, don't want to really do anything with that. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bum. I don't know even know why I went in there. Which are mine? <laughs> yep, this one's mine. Okay, that's castle. That's a bishop brick. Let's start uh, making a new vassal. Making a new vassal. I think you're Kamenia. Yeah, you're Kamenia. Okay, so down here, down here, down here. Uh, your new bishop brick. There we go. You. All right. Okay. Oh, can't really do anything with that right now. There we go. Did that one. Uh, make new vassal. Make new vassal. Ooh, you're a nice little province. Make new vassal. Make new vessel. Lovely cities. Alright. Go there. You. Nope, that's Kumania. So that all's Kumania in there. Oh, this one's me. Nope, nope. Already did that one. Already did that one. Okay, okay, we've gotten rid of a few of them. Uh, huh. Now what do I want to do? <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, God, I've got a lot of things to pass out. I mean, this is... Even though I, I love a good crusade, it's always great to get some new territory. But at the same time, I always hate doling out everything. Oh, God. This one down here. Yeah, you. Kiva itself. You are quite wonderful and prosperous, and I... Well, actually, you're not very prosperous, but you got a lot of things. So I'm gonna put someone good here. Hmm. Yeah, so we'll pass out some counties to some family members, and then give Kiva and sort of these core things to one person who I want to hand over the kingdom of Kiva, or the Republic of Kiva to. And them and Kumania can duke it out for the territory. That'll work. That'll be good. Okay, so bring out the family menu. My dynasty and my religion. Uh, uh, rulers, no. What am I looking at here? Adults, yes! I need adults. Hmm. How do I want to dull this stuff out? <laughs> well, clearly by people who... No, not ranked. Clearly by people who love me. Hmm. You, do you have children? You do, but only daughters. Ooh, Queen Eliza of Poland. Good for you. Good for you. You? No, yeah, that's, that's also a daughter. I need I need someone with sons. Or you, you you need a wife, but you, yeah, you'll find a wife. You'll find a wife. So, grand lady title. What do I want to give him? <laughs> hmm? That one? 
Ah, crap. I clicked out. <laughs> uh, 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 Chotch! That one! Have at it. Include the loader titles of it. Yes. Have Chotch. Enjoy, my friend. Enjoy. You know what the hell? Even though you only have a daughter, we'll give some to you, too. Uh, da, 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 da. Grand Landed title. Include the lower titles. Grand City of Ishim. How about it? Uh, uh, balls. <sighs> yeah, I, I brought that on myself there. I brought that on myself. Ha, ah, uh, boy. Um, will I then be able to hand over those cities? Hmm. You! No, well, you know, I'm just gonna give someone the kingdom of Kiva. Uh, but who? But who? You're alright. Only daughters. Daughters. Aha! You have a son! Wait, your son is that guy! I can roll with it. You at least got a son to pass down things to. Or I could just give it to the son. Nah, I give it to the old man. Yep. This is gonna be stupid, but okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Aha! It would hand over those things to them, because I just gave over that county. Perfect. 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 Thank crap. <laughs> oh, I didn't think about that with the vassal limit for a moment, but no, that's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, no, that still has me as that. Wait, what? Okay, Ishim. Ishim is the one. Okay, okay. Back to test. Test, test, test. One, two, three. <laughs> All right, yes, good. It's still, still in there. Lovely. Okay, okay. All right, we should be good still handing over everything to people. Wonderful. All right, well, let's keep handing down things. You know what? Your son will get a thing. Uh, what do I want to give him? Nope, not that one. Yeah, that one, sure. Boom. Uh, da, 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 da. You? Hmm. Only daughters. You have a son who's a bastard. Ah, you got a son. You got a thing. You got a thing. <laughs> That's, uh... Really my only criteria there. Do you have a son? All right, so putting more of my family out there in the world as a good plan. A good plan. Ah, you have a son. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Uh, that one, yeah, sure. And... Let's give out one more before I hand out the kingdom one. Hmm... Ah, you have multiple sons. Perfect. Okay. Da, 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 da. That one, yes, that'll work. And you know what? The rest, I'm handing over to that one, dude. Or do I want to? Maybe you. Ah, you don't have any sons, though. Ah, that's my problem. I need someone with sons who can, you know, pass down their land to another generation. And your son's a bastard, and you haven't legitimized him. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Daughters. Ah, you have a son! You have a son. And you're possessed! This could be interesting. <laughs> yes, let's give a kingdom title to a possessed man. The perfect plan. The perfect plan. <laughs> I actually like that idea. Let's do it! Blue loaded titles, there we go. All them folk. Have at ye! There we are, we're back to 16, and I'm back to my 10 and 9. Lovely! Okay, so that should be interesting. You're now a great ruler of men. You possessed bastard. <laughs> oh god, now I have to get my army to where I can get boats. You know what? It might actually be quicker just to walk them. Uh, 
Huh. No, because that's across a desert. That's They're going to get some serious freaking attrition. Oh, God. I think I may have to bring them all the way back here to bring boats in. Oh, God. <laughs> yep, that's going to be the quickest route. All right. There. There. And then I'll bring out my boats, and then we'll go deal with Egypt. <sighs> Freaking hell. Hi, Serene Republic of Egypt. We're coming for you, huh? You you took some land. I didn't give you all that. Good for you. You may be becoming one of my more powerful vassals now. What is this? Patrician Emmanuel of Savelli has given me bizarre and rep Impulsive evidence concerning uh, that guy's sexual preferences. <gasps> How should I use this juicy info? I'm trying to kill him. You know, I don't need to also smear him. I'll keep it to myself. <laughs> I'm already trying to murder the guy. I don't, I don't need to else. I don't need to rub some salt in the wound there. Eh. I'm already trying to annihilate his family and his entire line. <laughs> Can I kill you? Oh yeah, I already looked into that, didn't I? Hey, my co-conspirator is actually good. Oh, it is. It's Egypt too. Hi, good, good for you. So, oh, it's the it's the manure pit one again. They're gonna make him go kaboom. Perfect. Perfect. Did the Holy Roman Revolt just get big? Oh my God, it got bigger. Also, did you just change names? Well, I've been corresponding regularly with my sister, Vendane, the no oh, wow, I actually did name someone else Vendane a while back, but not the demonic one. And I always make sure to see her whenever I get the chance. It's a harsh world, and family must stick together. Wonderful! And this guy's dead. <laughs> and no trace of me left behind. Well, I need a new counselor after that horrifying scream. Hey, you. Alright, now what do I want to make you do? Uh, oh god, factions. France, hey, it's me. Alright. France! You're gonna get a, you're gonna get the Chancellor there, trying to make you like me more. There we go. Hmm, France's capital's actually in Paris right now. Good for them. Uh, how far for my people to march? Oh boy, that's gonna be a long march for them. I need to get out boats. How many have they got? Ah, uh, I need a little bit over 300 boats. All right. Fine. I'm actually making money somehow right now, so yay. Um. Oh my God, didn't I? Did I get more trade posts from the one family I killed? I don't remember. I can't... I, I didn't count before I he, he died. I should have counted. Because I don't think I was at 37. Yay! <laughs> Alright, let's get the boats. Uh, boats! Alright, we should be good with that one. And this one, actually. Yes, that's perfect. Good, 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 good. I'm actually at the 28-minute mark, so pretty much this will be my last act of the day. Wait, did I just see a giant army? Oh, I saw boats. Alright. Alright, get you there so we can get these people into the ships. Good. They'll arrive eventually. Okay, and yeah, that is actually going to be it for today. We're at the 29 minute mark, so basically the half hour. We uh, have started the murdering, the slow, methodical murder of another family. This one. Hey, the Savelli family is actually now a problem. Plot to kill. Yep, we're good. Basically, I'm just going to try and murder whoever else is high up. And Savelli seems to have uh, gained some ground. So we're going to murder him now. And then defend Egypt. And so, yes, that will be for next episode, though. I hope you all have enjoyed and that you do come back for the next. But until then, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one.